Hey guys, how's it going? Thanks for joining me for another Puzzle and Dragons video. Today I'm going to be trying to run through Machine Zeus Descended. War King Annihilation. This is like the most insane dungeon. I'm running it co-op with Evan, who is um, on Discord. They're on a co-op Discord chat. And... Let's see, we've got our set strategies here, because we've actually tried this a couple times, and just weren't really able to uh, nail it. Let's see, what I need to do right now is just match up a little bit. There we go. That's kind of exactly what I wanted to do. I wanted to generate some wood orbs. And let's see, if I'm looking down and doing anything, it's because um, we're on Discord chat. Evan is still at work and has taken a little break to help me with this run. <laughs> and it's our third time trying and the first time he remembered to use his Awoken Susano, which is inherited on uh, Isis, <laughs> so we can tank the next hit. <laughs> he is saying he did it and he is the best. Most definitely. I am quite excited to see um, just how great we'll be doing here. Um, excellent. All right, all right. Look at that. Barely hurt us. So we want to... Um, we're just taking this guy out now. Let's see. So we want to make a TPA. Let's go... Oh, man. It wouldn't be easy to make a TPA on that left side. So I think we're going to put it up top, even though... I really like putting TPAs along the sides, but we're gonna see how we do here. So a lot of light orbs. So I think I'm gonna try and move with a light orb. Um, and yeah, we're gonna have to really focus on the water orbs. They're kind of far apart. Uh, I could have made more matches there. I kind of messed up with the um, the light orbs. I kind of bunched them up, and I could have matched a bit better. But hey, we, we got past the stage. We're looking good. See, we're surviving all these preempts. Sitting pretty. Um, now, we've got some good inherits here. So I have Awoken Amaterasu on my Awoken Yomi, which I don't know if she'd be up, but she'd be able to heal. Um, let's see, when is she up though in two turns? That is too late. Hmm. Unfortunately, that would be too late. If we stalled one more turn, we could have had it. That's a little bit of an oversight. Um... We have to use them before floor six, so I think we could get them back up. I think that's the plan with different, um... <sighs> Okay, so we're gonna try to... This is a lot of strategizing. <laughs> like I said, it's our third time through, and the second time uh, we had an agonizing time with uh, Zeus. We got him almost down, but didn't have a TPA, so we ended up in a mess, wasted some stones, and um, wasn't too great. Let's see, so we're gonna stall. So when you're stalling, what you wanna do is match the top. Um, I could try and set up a good board for him. Maybe I could try and do that. I just don't wanna accidentally leave the good board there. Um, you know what, I'm not gonna try and be fancy. We're gonna stall at the top. We have plenty of light orbs, so we're just gonna do that. Just real easy. And actually I generated a dark orb, which is perfect. So now we have all the orbs we need. He can make an easy match and TPA. Um, so we should be a-okay. I 
Yeah, I'm seeing, yeah, that bottom match there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Everything is looking very nice. Oh, I think we might have gotten a little bit lucky there because we we're on the 4x combo, but um, we managed to hit that 9x, which of course would wipe them right out. Okay. So we obviously don't want to get hit. Okay, Raw and Ichigo next floor. Wait, why is Raw not up? Oh, it is available. He doesn't have his, uh, doesn't have an inherit, so it wasn't uh, uh, very apparent to me. Okay, so down go the little uh, gear, gear dudes. Gear dudes are out. Okay, we want to take this guy on out. We want to go ahead and use Ichigo here so that we can kill and heal at the same time. And we do have extra time to make this combo. So hopefully that means um, we won't be screwing it up. We've got a lot of dark orbs to work with, which is good and bad. So I want to make sure I get a TPA and don't um, uh, clump them up too much. I think we'll be okay. Okay, not the best with healing because I left two hearts on the board and we're not getting any more. Basically, that was stupid. <laughs> we will definitely kill him, but now we're short two orbs here. So not the best case scenario, um, but I think we'll be okay. We're up to 25K with our health. We deal with a preempt there, but it's gonna pass off and we have Awoken Isis right back up to clear off. There we go. Now the deal here, I believe we just wanna go and smoke on through. I guess it would be ideal to have a TPA and a match but like I said, with me putting, um, oh, look at that nice TPA Skyfall. That was very, that deserves a nice TPA Skyfall. Like that was beautiful. All those combos, that damage shield is not going to work there. All right. We are flying through right now. Let's see. Um, the plan would be. Well, I believe we don't want to get hit. Okay, yeah, the plan is just Okuni and kill. So, let's hope that we can manage to pull that off. I really wish I hadn't left those stupid uh, hearts on the board. They're just kind of right in the way. Okay, now I'm gonna go right side for the TPA and we're just gonna build going across. So let's see how we do here. Uh, come on, type advantage. Oh yeah, whoo! You always worry when you're only hitting five combos there, but we made it through. That TPA is just killer. And this guy, I believe he's machine type. And we've got a machine kill attribute. Machine killer attribute, I should say. Um, so we could just give him a little taparuni. I think he literally has one, uh, one HP. There we go. All right, we are flying through here, looking good. Okay. Back to me. <laughs> he got the tap for one HP and now it's back to me. And we're looking for a one shot kill here. Um, okay, we've got plenty of good orbs available to us. So I'm gonna try and go ahead and make the TPA in kind of an unusual spot, but I'm gonna move with this guy here.
Okay. Oh no, did I not make a TPA? Uh oh, did I make a TPA? Oh my god. That is a problem. Uh, okay. That's an issue. This run was going so very smooth, and I screwed the pooch on that one. Way to go, Alpha. Now we got a bunch of lock, locked orbs, jammers. Oh, man. I can't even, Can I peek at them? No, I can't do anything right now. Uh, okay, so he's peeking at the orbs. In co-op, when your partner is peeking, um, you don't see any of the animation. So I guess it's, you know, saving on whatever network traffic or whatever it might be. They don't broadcast everything, which is why I think the movement looks a little weird. You just kind of see the orb flipping around and see, instead of seeing the orb dragging. Oh, man, Mr. TPA. I hope that doesn't throw off our little, uh, our setups here. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. We want to... We want to try and get a zero stone clear here. That would be nice. That would definitely be nice. Wow, what a guy. Saw right through that. Let's see, we got a TPA. Oh yeah. What a move. What a move. Yeah, we're going to have to use the pass here. Um, so we've got a Orochi Inherit on Lucifer. So it gives us plenty of time to do this here. There we go. Clear everything off. How are we looking with five turns before he's up? So we're not going to have our board maker up, which is kind of a bummer. Um, so we're just kind of stalling here. I guess we're just clearing off. Let me just do that just so we get rid of our last. Um, let me not get too cute. I don't want to accidentally. Uh, yeah, see, now we only have three fire orbs on the board. Oh, it's going to come down to me going for the kill shot, isn't it? Oh, no, it would be him going for it. Uh, we can't match up those poisons. That's going to wreck us. Oh, there we go. Satsuki got rid of them. Fantastic. I don't know if he's... Yeah, I don't think we're trying to go for kill shot here. No, no, no. We're still just stalling here. Clearing out excess orbs, getting us some more colors on the board. Oh, okay. We're going to get an attack in. That's what happens when you have a no recovery. Oh, yeah. That's not what we wanted, but I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Um. Oh man, he wants he wants me to go for the kill. <laughs> so if you don't see, there is an eight turn combo shield here. Um. Let's see. Um, unfortunately, he is not up. Okay, we're gonna try and match the jammers and hope we don't get. Okay, we got our strategy here. We're gonna match up there. Okay, we're gonna use a stone. We're okay. 
I guess when there's no, um, there's chances of different stuff happening, including getting bound, um, or, or, uh, that. <laughs> okay, if we're at a one stone Zeus run, you know, it's not horrible. We're going to see, I don't know if he's going to pop my active as well. I have Awoken Frasia inherited on there. Um, so it's going to be just silly, silly damage. Because we have Machine Killer, we have a boost to Devils, and that would be a boost to Dark. Um, and Green, but in our case, Dark. And he used an Awoken Yomi inherit, so he's going to have plenty of time to move. But he's got to get to eight combos. I have to say, I'm happy that he's doing it and not me. Um, I was the one that hosted, and I'm the one paying for it. But and he's he's beaten this many times. This is this would be my first clear. Uh, so I'd get a stone back at least. Uh, but I don't mind that he he's going for, <laughs> for the eight combos and not me. Um, I can I can hit eight combos when there's no pressure. But uh, this isn't a situation like that. <laughs> So let's see what we have in store here. I think he's going to do it. I think he's got this in the bag. Has plenty of time here. Oh yeah, that looks beautiful. We got nine combos there. Oh geez, 13, 14. I think that'll do it. We didn't have a TP, but it's just not going to matter, I don't think. Oh yeah, just one shot right to the shield. Just smoked him. So that was very fun playing uh, some co-op with someone that has run the dungeon and knows how to, um, you know, knows what each of the stages are and what kind of mechanics you want to bring to each of them. That's kind of the, the fun of running co-op there. So we got all sorts of uh, drops, including uh, this guy. Who does he skill up? Oh, he skills up Awoken Orochi. I already used uh, Bud P on him. <laughs> and there he is, Machine Zeus in all of his glory. So we have our co-op leader there. Three and a half attack when HP is full. Two and a half attack and recovery when playing with another player. So that is quite a powerful lead. And... Um, yeah, we almost had a zero... Um, But all in all, a very good run. A single stone used. Like I said, that was our third time trying. So um, kind of, kind of, uh, you know, not the best, but we we made it. It's a challenging dungeon, and many thanks to Evan for helping me through the dungeon. And I'll be doing a lot more co-op. It seems to be quite fun. It's stamina efficient, and I think you'll be seeing me on Discord quite a bit, and maybe in our own Discord channel. We'll see what's happening soon. Um, until next time, Alpha out.